everyone, Billy Goat Sports Cards back for a video. And today we have a couple mystery packs. And the mystery packs here, uh, these were, I believe, I got them off of eBay. They were approximately 45 each. And this was a Luca mystery pack. So um, the big hits were the uh, Luca prism. And uh, it says right here. So every pack contains, we'll just go through that. Every pack contains at least one autograph and one relic patch and five additional uh, all individually protected cards randomly inserted. <clears throat> As you see there, randomly inserted. It's a 2018 Prism uh, PSA 9 of Luca, And then a Freshman Phenom Silver Prism PSA 10. And then a 2018 Panini Chronicles uh, PSA 10. And so my little bubbly is showed up. Yes, bubbles. Are you getting all wet? Yeah. Uh-oh. Bear go change. He's been playing in the water, brushing his teeth. So this is uh, limited to 300 packs. And uh, just first off, you know, just feeling the packs. That's where the, the cards end that high. Um, they are not. So if we take a, a holder they are ending right where a holder would end. So there's no PSA in there. And then same here, uh, ends right there, no PSA in there. So let's see if, if we, uh, what the value is or how we do on these. Um, you know, there's some autograph cards and some different things. So we'll see if it's a, a good value or not. And it's from absolute, just so you guys can see there it's a absolute memorabilia that is the name of the uh the ebay all right see a milwaukee buck on the back Bye. not a a big name buck but it, oh that's our autograph ursan ursalova out of 199 either way it's a buck you know that's kind of cool we're bucks fans and not a big ursan fan but um not bad i mean as far as get the first auto is is a milwaukee buck so uh, just give me one second here i'm just gonna grab a couple stands should have had those out right away but um still moving into the house here getting things organized but We'll put Ursan there to start out with, and, and maybe he'll be replaced really quick. So next is our, this is our memorabilia for the Nuggets, Evan Fournier, Fournier. And that is a totally certified Next, we have a rook. Uh, it's a Jermaine O'Neal, and that's a top, so that's a little bit older. That's kind of cool. So, that is a 2007 tops. The 50th anniversary, 2007. Jermaine O'Neal. And here's a few others that are sleeved. An optic of Nicholas Batum. A Jordan Poole mosaic NBA debut. And then there's a Derrick Rose prospect ticket. That is a 2000, let's see here, Derrick Rose. That's a 2020 prospect ticket. And career lineage, lineage. Career lineage for Jason Kidd. And then the last card in the pack is a Luka Doncic. So that's kind of cool. 
Chronicles, Luca. So that would be definitely the the high end card of that pack. Um, I'm not sure what that Luca. I don't think that Luca goes for a ton online. So I would say out of that pack, definitely not did not hit the the value of the purchase. But it's it's always a gamble. You're always trying to to hit the big one, right? see who we got here so <clears throat> we're gonna go like this and our first one is a pink Jeremiah Grant for the Nuggets for Mosaic and then a Bogdan Bogdanovich for the Kings a Jarrett Culver rookie it's not too bad just a base rookie, but and then another Derek Rose contenders ticket, and here is a patch card of Rodney Carney, and this is a flare, so this is a this is a bit older. Let's see here, yeah, this is 0607 uh, flare, so. And then uh, Alan Krabby for the Hawks. It is a prism patch. And our autograph is Noah Vindler, I think. If you look at the back there. Yeah, Vonler. Noah Vonle Vonley. Vonley. Noah Vonley. Fast break auto. And then our last one, again, from Chronicles. This is the uh, Panini base Luca rookie. So the, the uh, highlight, obviously, the two Luca rookie cards. Uh, you know, not definitely, I don't believe they're quite at that $40 range but um, they may be and if they grade out who knows the way Luca plays these days and his popularity I mean just cards to hold on to but uh, just fun to go after Luca's and the price of the uh, the price of buying packs uh, from 1819 is ridiculous so I thought this would be a little better way to chase after a few Lucas so hopefully you enjoyed that and uh, once again if you haven't hit that subscribe, please do. We do appreciate it. And uh, we're going to get back into being a little more consistent with our videos. Get Hopefully get into getting some new product. But uh, yeah, that's that. So have a great day, guys.